Let's see a couple of solutions on how you can fix the row shade for Roblox not working properly on your PC or laptop. This is a quite simple tutorial, so follow my steps and watch this video until the very end because I have a couple of different solutions for you. The problem where row shade is not working is usually caused by compatibility issues with the Roblox application, and the problem can also be caused by an outdated row shade version, or because of some conflicting apps on your PC. The first fix for this problem is to make sure that the Roblox client is not running on your PC. We'll open up our task manager and then go over to the processes section. In here, we want to end all of the processes that could change our game files, or the processes that could show an overlay while we are in-game. Those apps could be Steam, CCleaner, maybe some Adobe applications like Photoshop or Premiere Pro, or other similar applications. We also have to make sure that any third-party Roblox apps, like Rose Shade, are not running. If they are, just end the task and close them completely. When you do this, we can go over to roshade.com and then download the latest version of Rose Shade to our PC. Maybe you have an outdated version of Rose Shade and that's why it's not working. So simply download the latest version from this website and then you want to run the installer. Simply follow the on-screen instructions and install Roshade to your PC or laptop. If you can't find the website or you're having problems with accessing the download link, then I'll leave a link in the description of this video where you will open the GitHub website and you can download Roshade from there. Just make sure to run the installers and reinstall the shaders that you need for Roblox. This will take you a couple of minutes to complete, and you'll have a new desktop shortcut created on your home screen. After this step, you can launch Roblox using the new shortcut and see if Roshade is working for you. If you're still having problems with this, then the problem may be with the Roblox client itself. You want to search for Roblox player in the search bar, and then we'll open the file location for the Roblox player. Right-click on the Roblox player shortcut and then open the file location one more time. When we do this, we'll find the Roblox Player Launcher app and then we have to go over to the Properties. Right-click on it, then find the Properties option. We have to go over to the Compatibility section and check this Disable Full Screen Optimization setting. The last step is to apply the changes, and this should fix your problem. You should have Rose Shade working again without an issue. And some users were able to fix the problem by whitelisting the Rose Shade app in their antivirus software. Maybe that will also work for you if the first three methods didn't. If some of these solutions and fixes worked for you, or you have any suggestions, make sure to leave them in the comments down below and I'll see you in the next video.